Hey guys, Adam Johnson here, Tackle HD Pro Staffer, and I uh, want to bring you a quick tip today about uh, a little trick I've, I've found to, uh, to, to help uh, rig up the Tackle HD High Def Craw uh, maybe a little bit differently now. Um, I'll say that you know 90% of the time I, I go with the, uh, with the Stealth jig head made specifically for it, and uh, for good reason, it, uh, it, it works. But, like I said, there's you know 5% of the time the lakes are rising right now. We got uh, a ton of cover in the water, bushes everywhere. Where uh, you know Texas rigging and and, uh, and, and flipping that that high def craw, uh, you know a lot of people uh, just think of it as, as throwing it on the uh, the stealth jig head, but but it's actually a great flipping bait as well. Now, uh, one thing that I do do with it that's uh, that's what I was saying. My little tip here for you today is uh, is is when you get your your craw out and you get it Texas rigged. One of the things that you notice, and, and uh, I prefer a, a 3 aught Superline uh, Gamakatsu uh, extra wide gap flipping hook, uh, seems to be about the right fit, especially like I said when you're flipping, is that when that fish bites, you know, the, the high def craw is a full body bait, and, and for good reason, because uh, you get great um, durability out of it, especially on that, that uh, stealth jig head but like I said uh, because it is a full body bait when that fish bites down on that that full body does kind of get in the way and you only get a little bit of hook exposed so what I do my little trick is uh, is when I get one of these HD craws out take a razor blade or, or anything sharp pocket knife or anything like that would work and I take it and I just make a short little cut right in the middle of that bait and when I do that gap so I take my my hook take my hook and insert it and now you see when that fish bites down on that look how much more that's exposed that the bottom of that hook goes into that gap that you made there and all of a sudden when you look at the two to compare how much more exposed hook you have and, and I, I found that, that really uh, improves my hookup percentage and you know if you're a tournament angler uh, it doesn't matter how many bites you get you got to put them in the boat and uh, and I think that little tip will help you next time you need to flip the heavy stuff <clears throat> Try that little tip, it might help you out.